Welcome to Nike's Human Race here in Sunny Valley, Michigan. Chris Nicholas, who is not only the race director for the Every Stride race here in Belding, Michigan, but he's the founder. And this year it was a special race because you had a connection with the Nike Plus Human Race. Congratulations, Chris. Thanks so much, Jenny. It was an honor to uh, to have Nike Plus on the Human Race this year. It was a Gazelle Sports phone call that, that made it all happen. And uh, last year with 750 participants, we didn't expect it to grow this much. And uh, now over 2,000 participants in the second year. I just, I'm kind of blown away and I, I haven't even really digested what what uh, what has happened today well it's kind of amazing you had a big tent and you really needed it but one of the other amazing things is how many people ran the 5k and the 10k you know that's right it, it was great to see that when I stood up there at the start of the line and I looked back at the 5k I was just amazed and then I thought okay with the weather conditions as it was would we have that many people in the 10k and when I stood up there again and looked back it was just spectacular it was spectacular, and people were very complimentary about the, the courses. Uh, the ones who ran the golf course this morning were kind of wishing they had their spikes or else they had them. The guy who won did have spikes. So. Yeah, and I think, you know, and, and we learn a lot. We learn a lot from their feedback, and, and being a runner myself, it's just like I would have liked to partake in the in the course, you know, designing the course with, with our committee. I never had a chance to run the course, so I'm going to have to get out one of these days and get out there and, and, and experience that. Well, people were very happy with it, and the other thing that that really distinguishes this race was the great spread you had afterwards. I'm telling you, it was a feast. <laughs> well, the post-race party, you know, we team up with the Metro Health Grand Rapids Marathon. Don Kern, but it's a, an amazing event on the week prior. And then we say, you know what, we have all those marathoners out in Grand Rapids, and why don't we invite them to a post-race party? You know, sometimes you get done at 2.20 or, or 3 hours or 4 hours, and and uh, so it, it's it's like, let's get everybody together. So we do that the week after, and, and we have burgers and brats and chicken and and all of that and 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 this year we had to because looking at the numbers you know when we made when we pulled the trigger for the tent we said you know we need an 80 by 140 foot tent for everybody and uh, you know you, you kind of you have to you have to kind of say oh how much does that cost but you know it's certainly worth it because you know to be able to see so many familiar faces in the running community out there uh, it's just it, it, it gives you this great feeling because it's it's a it's it's a great time to be as a race director and, and see all these faces come across with smiles and, and achievements and, and how did you do today and, and it's a, it's a great feat and the winners, including the Masters winners, were especially happy because they got gear. Can you tell us about that real quick? They did. Nike uh, provided uh, a, a Nike Plus system to all the overall male and female and Masters male and female. They also got a free pair of Nike shoes and, uh, and then obviously a crystal trophy as well to, t to put on their mantle. So, and, and uh, five deep medals. You had a lot of people going home happy. Congratulations again, Chris. Hey, thank you so much.